Now we have finished investing our 100,000 francs. We split it in over 20 shares, so that each stock has not more than 5% of the total company of the total portfolio value. And that's very important, because that means if we make losses in our portfolio, it doesn't hurt us as much. And I want to talk about the losses today. We have here Nokia Corporation, the company which has had the highest loss this summer. And actually a company where I had a very flo uh, funny blog entry. In German it rhymed. I tried to make a translation in English. It was something like this, can it do spamming? No, it's too stupid for that. It can only do speaking. <laughs> something like that in German, but it sounded really funny in German. And I must say, if I had listened to that blogger, I would have sold the stock again and I would have not made that loss. Can we know this in advance? Not really. As a matter of fact, if I look at the other losses, Electrolux, which is um, uh, household appliances, Metro, which is retail space, and Smith & Nephew, which is a, a UK uh, defense company, I must say these companies have nothing to do with each other. Of course, retrospectively, we can always explain why we had a loss. Afterwards, it's possible to know the truth. But the more important thing is actually something else. We buy 20 stocks so that each loss doesn't hurt us as much. We on, it only hurts us 5% on average. So in Nokia Corporation, we, do, we, didn't lo, we didn't lose 18%. We lost 1%, a little bit less than 1% of our total portfolio. And that makes my investing decision a lot safer. You should do that too. I wish you good luck with your own investing.